So I figured I would play some Crystallis from memory. I played it a lot as a kid, and I've been kind of interested in doing it again recently. So we'll try the first section. Here we go. Nineteen ninety seven, October first, end of days. Only 100 years have passed. I guess that's quite a while in the grand scheme of things. Dramatic reveal. Stretch our legs a little bit. Up, down, left, right. B and A do not do anything right now. So we'll bust our way out of this cave. That dude is really nervous that we're coming out of the cave. Who knows how long he's been standing there. So we'll cruise over to here and wander through this town. Well, maybe I can help with that. So I remember you know, to talk to people, you just kind of run into them. Bam. I always wondered what the protagonist had said to prompt people to say stuff. Maybe they're just so nervous that someone's just walking up and staring them in the face. So anyway, if we go into this house... Some dude just gives you money. Excellent. So now we can... Down here... Buy the, um... Alarm flute. Nothing else right now. Got a hunch, we've got to start the windmill. Yes, I did. No pressure. Master using it, and you can have this. Alright, so now we have a sword. Select will take you into this menu, and then A, I think, will equip the sword, Sword of Wind, and we can kill some slimes. And try 
not to die. Oh, that's right, I can charge up a distance attack. Keep a safe distance. I guess these look kind of like tigers or something. At any rate, I usually build up to like level 3 here or so. Makes the next areas a little bit easier. Wander through this cave. No enemies, but the wise man is at the end. Good old days when you collected money. Yay! Collected money every time you uh, kill an enemy. Realizing now how difficult it is to kind of do commentary when you're concentrating on something. I don't think I feel like building up to level 3 right here. It's taking long. Let's cruise up. We'll kill things along the way. So over this bridge, there'll be a cave. Dude sleeping in here. Nothing will wake his ass up. Other than a alarm flute. Don't 
Don't do that again. Well, I won't because it uses the item and we can never use it again. So windmill key, take over here. This looks like a promising place to use it. The keyhole there. But a long time ago a friend showed me that you don't actually have to use it near the keyhole. Yay, a new path opens. Should probably go buy some armor or something. I'm naked with just a t shirt on. Tanned hide. The type of thing your mother says to you when you're a kid. Tan your hide, boy. Ooh, now I'm decked out. Got some armor. Refresh. It's a uh, healing spell. If you go in, you can hold down the button to heal. Alright. So we'll just get, we'll, we'll kill everything we run into in this cave. That's always a good idea when you go into caves. Just kill everything. Really should have saved this. I believe you can just save anywhere in the overworld. So in case I die, I really have to start the game all over again. Uh, start? Yeah. Looks I could save restore state. Or save state. But we'll go OG with it. Well, how many did these get? About two each? That was worth coming in here. Seventy-five slimes and we can build up another level. Not really. Alright, so the next item we can find is the Ball of Wind. It allows us to build up to charge level 2. I've got no way to heal poison, I just realized. So I gotta cruise back to the town.
cruising, cruising back to town. I don't want to die. Eh. Run, dude, run. Don't remember if the inn will cure it. Find out. Yes, it does. So, what did we learn? We'll purchase some antidotes. Two of them, anyway. Alright. So that helps. If we get poisoned again, we can at least cure it. Back up to the cave. Mysterious cave no one's entered in a thousand years. Monsters run rampant. Those guys give three experience each. Warp boots. You can use them once and warp to a town. We've only been to one town so far, but... If we got poisoned a bunch and ran out of antidotes, we could warp back to town. So these bats... Sometimes a pain. Alright, so there's the ball of wind. If we go in and equip it, we can now ha charge level 2 and get myrtleized by bats. One, two, break the stone wall. Check all four of these passageways for loot. Nothing there. More bats. I almost want to build up to level 4 right here. Just because I know the boss of this cave can sometimes cause a headache. Thank you. 
Kill this dude, he gives us four experience, I think. Almost there. Alright, level four. That'll make our lives a little bit easier coming up here. Old school level grinding. Something that went away in the last what, decade or so. I kind of have mixed feelings on it, I guess. But, that's a topic for a different time. Alright, that looks like a boss room. what this is. Rabbit boots. Notice we could not jump before, but now, with the rabbit boots, we can make a happy little hopping noise everywhere we go. And that gets us to a new area. Alright, Thanks for watching. We'll pick it up next time. Check out this new area.